Ever wondered what mummies have to tell us about the past? Well, buckle up, because we're about to dive into the world of mummies and archaeology. For many, mummies are the stuff of legends, eerie remnants from long ago that spark our curiosity and sometimes our fears. But for archaeologists and historians, mummies are a treasure trove of knowledge, a window into ancient cultures that have long since vanished from the earth. They hold secrets of past civilizations, their beliefs, their rituals, and their way of life. Mummification, the process of preserving the body after death, has been practiced by various cultures around the globe. Yet it's the ancient Egyptians who are most famously associated with it. They believed that preserving the body in death was crucial for the soul's journey in the afterlife. However, mummification wasn't exclusive to the land of the pharaohs. From the frozen tundra of Siberia to the arid deserts of China, mummies have popped up in the most unexpected places, each with a unique story to tell. Take, for instance, Liuan, a thousand-year-old mummy from China, whose body is so well-preserved that it gives us a glimpse into the life and times of the Song dynasty. Or the Tollan man from Denmark, a bog person from the Iron Age, whose body, astonishingly, still has supple skin and flexible joints. And then there's the Lady of Dai, another Chinese mummy whose remarkably preserved body allowed scientists to determine that she suffered from heart disease, likely due to a poor diet and obesity. But not all mummies are human. The discovery of a mummified wolf cub in northern Canada reveals how even animals were subjected to the mummification process providing us with invaluable insights into the ecology of the past. Each of these mummies holds a piece of the puzzle, a fragment of the past that helps us understand our own history and our place in the world. 